Hello, honey pie. Come away in and see who's at home today. Granny Murray's house has two at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home too. Who's here today? Well, we've got Ho and we've got Molly. But don't just sit there, my wee spring chickens. Come on, let's have some fun. What's in Granny Murray's shelves today? Papers. Yes, papers. Bring them over. That's the way. You scrunch that one into a bowl. And a little bit more on. Some tape round it. That looks perfect. Who's good at catching a ball? Yes? Okay. Good catch. Back to Granny Murray. Molly? Good girl. That's the way. Whoa, that was a high one. Well, we've got Hope and we've got Molly. But someone's missing from home today. Oh, not anymore. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? Oh, yes. It's Rebecca with Mickey John. Hello there. Mickey John. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> and Rebecca. Come away through my honey pie. You doing it by yourself? Oh, what your fingers? <laughs> we've been playing with a paper ball. Hey, we've got a football match at school later. My class versus Mrs Pike's class. Mm. Oh, it'll be like the World Cup final. Oh, football, eh? Oh, that gives me a good idea. Why don't you all dress Claude up as a footballer, eh? He can be the goalkeeper. Hey. And uh, Mickey John, hit the ball. Oh, <laughs> down the wing, Granny Murray. Your ball. Come on. <laughs> oh, great shot, Granny Murray. You win the match. <laughs> I just suppose you fancy playing in my team, do you? I could use a good goal scorer. <laughs> oh, no, I wouldn't have a puff. Oh, yes, you've got to be very fit to play football. I've been out training with my team every lunchtime. Oh, and what about Miss Pike? Miss Pike's out training every lunchtime and every day after school. They're fit as fiddles. Well, it should be a good match. Well, it's going to be a hard game to win. Miss Pike has a lot of the best players. She's got uh, Ronnie Bickerstaff, she's got Elizabeth Tamworth and uh, Reggie Thornton. Oh, they could easily beat us. Oh, well, it's only a game and it's only for fun. Only a game? Yes, you mustn't take a game too seriously. <laughs> oh, look at Claude. Oh, Claude, you look like a professional goalkeeper. <laughs> Oh, great save, Claude. Did you see his lightning reflexes? <laughs> Come on, you. Off to your work. OK. Oh, look at this. A miniature football. That can be our mascot in the game today. Bye-bye, sweetheart. Have fun with Granny Murray. <laughs> Come on, you. Now remember, it's only a game and it's only for fun. Thank you, Granny Murray. I'll see you later. Bye-bye, my darling. We'll be thinking of you. Me too. Will you keep a wee eye on Mickey John? Make sure he goes the right way to work. I'm on my way to work today Walking my shoes through the city views Stepping along and swinging my arms Singing my way through the city's charms Getting there is just so fine I so enjoy my walking time I always go the way I know Can you show me the way I go? OK, which way? Do I go left now? Do I go right? Which way is wrong now? Which way is right? Right! OK, right, to the school I'm on my way to work today Looking this way and that away Hello, Ali! Hello, doors! Hello, steeple! Hello, walls! Hello, people! Do I go up now? Do I go down? Which way's a smile now? Which way's a frown? Up! OK, that way. Up! You told me the way to go. Thank you. You showed me the way I know. Thanks for that.
Now, what have I got to do? Ah, yes, time for a tie. All dressed and ready to go. Ah, hiya, Mickey John. Are you ready for the match? Oh, yes, I'm really excited. I can't wait for the match to start. Come on, you Reds! <laughs> hey, look, I've brought you some uh, tops that your team might like to wear. Oh, brilliant. Thanks, Bobby. So, are you coming along to see the match? You bet. I'm going to be there with me scarf. Although, I'm not really sure yet which team I'm going to be supporting. You what? Well, you know, I'm a big fan of Miss Pikes. She's really sporty. And her children are brilliant at games, especially that Vicky Beckham. She's always scoring goals. Yeah, yeah, but I got Geordie Ross on my team. Now, that's what you call a good goalie. Whoa! Brilliant save by Geordie Ross! <laughs> well, anyway, we'll see, we'll see. Listen, I've got to go because I'm going to be late for picking Kai up from nursery. I'll see you later. Bye. Bye. Hmm. I'd better work on my team plan for the match. That's Mickey John's team on the attack. Quick one, two, an overhead shot. It's a goal! <laughs> I wish you were playing on my team, Bex. I love to skip in river singing. I'd love to have seen that. What are you doing now, Daddy? <laughs> Maybe we can play football at the weekend, Rebecca. Hi, Mickey John. Oh, hello, Raymond. <laughs> are the trains running today? No, I've got the day off. Actually, I've just dropped off Lisa to have a look around the school. Ah, oh, yes, it's buddy day today. That's it. One of the older pupils is showing her the ropes. What was her name again? Elizabeth Tamsworth, <laughs> ah. the one that's really good at football. Yeah, and who plays for Miss Pike's team. Don't remind me. Yeah. Well, seeing as I have the day off, I was thinking of showing Granny Murray and Rebecca around the costume store in the garage. Do you reckon Rebecca would like that? Oh, Rebecca would love that, but I think Granny Murray's taken her for a kickabout round the park. Oh. Well, they won't be very long doing that. Not when it starts raining, anyway. Oh, it's not going to rain. It can't. We've got a football match to play. Oh, well, if you say so. Well, I'll go and see Granny Murray. Cheer you. Bye. Oh, there's the bell. And here comes my class. Morning. 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 Right, class. We're going to work really hard this morning, so we're all ready to play football this afternoon. And that means me too. It's time to get down to some hard work. Oh, oh, oh. With joy when I go to school in the morning. Teach with my chums and see the children learning. School day, work away. I'm learning, learning, learning when I'm teaching. I'm teaching, learning, teaching, learning, teaching. School day, work away. Teaching to count and teaching to read. Learn about birds and plants and seeds. Playing games and sports outdoors. Blowing my whistle and keeping a score. Secretary smiling as she does her organising. The Johnny fixes, the cookie mixes, and the cleaner keeps us shining. Oh, what joy when I go to school in the morning. All on the line in the dinner queue while the cookie cooks and serves a stew. Answering the questions where and why. How does it work and how does it fly? I'm learning, learning, learning when I'm teaching. Children peep and eye me as they sit and try their writing. I take a look, I mark their books, the good ones get a smiley. Oh, what joy when I go to school in the morning. Well done, everyone. You've all worked really hard this morning, so I'll see you this afternoon out on the football pitch. Off you go. Oh, it's time for me to get ready. I better go off into the team changing room. Oh, 
Oh, I love dressing up for football, and I'm gonna love this match. I wonder if you're dressing up too, Rebecca. I love to skip in River Sea Pingle, River Sea Pingle, that's for me. Wow, girls, give us a twiddle. <gasps> oh, fantastic. Are you having fun dressing up in Raven's costumes? Me too. <laughs> oh. oh, Raven, can Rebecca try that one on? Yeah, let's see how you look in this, Rebecca. <laughs> Come on, my darling, let's see you. <gasps> Look at you! You could have a part in one of Raymond and Tina's shows. Do you think your dad would like to see you in this? Yeah. <laughs> Wish me luck in the match, Rebecca. Oh, I'd better go and check the pitch. Oh, it's going to be a great match. Come on, you Reds! Oh, oh no! Oh, it's raining, just like Raymond said. I was so looking forward to the game. Mickey John's class versus Miss Pike's class. Oh, now it's pouring with rain. How are we going to play our game? Where did the time go? At seven o'clock, I dropped Rebecca off at Granny Murray's house. We played with a paper football and it was fun. And the children dressed Claude as a goalkeeper. I told Granny Murray all about the big match. My class against Miss Pike's class. At eight o'clock, I got to work. Bobby dropped off some football shirts for my team, but she wasn't sure which team to support. She said that Miss Pike's team have some really good players. At nine o'clock, Raymond called by to ask if Rebecca would like to see some of his theater costumes. As he went, he said it looked like it was going to rain. At 12 o'clock, my class went off for lunch and I got changed into my football kit. I was really excited about the match and I really wanted my class to win. At one o'clock, I ran out onto the football pitch and slipped in the mud. It started to rain. My class will never beat Miss Pike's class if we can't even play the game. Now remember, it's only a game and it's only for fun. It's only a game and it's only for fun. Granny Murray's right. I'm taking this all far too seriously. If we can't play outside because of the rain, well, we'll just have to make our fun indoors. But it's a race against time. I gotta do it, I gotta do it I gotta beat the clock before the chime I gotta sort it, I gotta sort it I gotta do the job on time Like a busy bee, I'm gonna beat that bong I'm gonna finish this job before I finish this song Do we think he's gonna do it? Do the job that needs to be done Will he know how to fix it? Will he finish what he has begun? I'm gonna beat the clock before the chime. I'm gonna sort it. He's gonna start it. I'm gonna do the job on time. I like a busy bee. I'm gonna beat that bong. I'm gonna finish this job before I finish this song. Right, is my team all ready? Yes. Miss Pike, your team ready? Yes. Yeah. Okey doke. Hang on, don't stop without me. Ooh. Come on, you reds. And uh, come on, you blues. <laughs> right, time for the kickoff. I don't really know. Doesn't matter though. We all had fun, that's the main thing. Right, everyone, off you go to the changing rooms. Well done. Thank you. <laughs> Goal! <laughs> I wonder if you managed to play football, Rebecca. Oh, Raymond's got the ball. Oh, oh, and he passes it to anybody. And a dribble. Oh, 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 oh. oh. <laughs> Mickey 
John. Hi, Granny Marie. Ha ha, come our way through. Rebecca, Daddy's here. Ah, hello, beautiful girl. Hello, Daddy. Oh, looks like you've had a lovely time. Yeah. Oh, we certainly did. It was a pleasure. Thank you, Granny. Oh, my special girl. <laughs> You're good as gold. And it's thanks from me too, Granny Murray. You're saying it's only a game and it's only for fun. Save the day. I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> Come on, you two. Ho, ho. <laughs> Too. Come on, Rebecca, let's chat about our time away. And I suppose you want me to tell you all about my time too? Well, there was laying, running, creeping, jumping, chasing, painting, laughing, digging, bathing, dressing, singing, swinging, walking, sliding, hunting, hiding, jumping up and turning round, dressing up and sitting down. <sighs> but what was really special about today? Well, Claude was dressed as a goalkeeper because we made a paper football today. And when Mickey John dropped off Rebecca, he told how he was really looking forward to the big match at school. His class were playing Miss Pike's class. I took the children to play ball in the park. Later, Raymond invited us to see his theatre costumes at the garage. We had such fun dressing up. Then we had a game of paper football outside the garage when it stopped raining. <laughs> I can't remember who won because we were all wearing different costumes but it was only a game and only for fun and that's what Mickey John found out too when the rain made him play his big match in the classroom. Oh! <laughs> Goal! Woohoo! I hope you enjoyed yourself. Me too. Bye bye honey pie. I love you Down to the city, the city. where the fairy folks dance the blues. Time to call 